Do I look like a tomato? Good morning, everybody. Today is Saturday, and today is the day that Ben and I go and get our West Elm couch. I am so excited. My dad and I are headed towards Vancouver now, and Ben is gonna meet us there because we stayed in North Van. Today's vlog is literally just gonna be us going and getting the couch. Oh, and also I'm going to a home goods sale at Monica Hibbs Barn, so that's super cool. I bought a ticket to go, and we're going at 3 p.m., so we're kinda headed towards the end of the day, but hopefully we still get some good stuff. So yeah, I just wanted to do a morning check-in, tell you guys what the day was gonna be like, and I'll probably see you when we're in Vancouver. Okay, so we've got the couch in the back of the trailer and Ben and my dad are just putting on the straps now to keep it in place. They honestly didn't do a very good job at like wrapping it. Like this whole thing is exposed, so I'm a bit nervous. But Ben and my dad say it'll be fine. <laughs> yeah. We're going to be storing this at Ben's parents' place. So now that we've got it in the trailer, we gotta go to our fan. Yeah, aren't they? Like, we kind of need to tuck them in a little bit more, right? Oh. Okay, I'm gonna tuck these in. Yeah. Dad. <laughs> oh, I'm so annoying. Hold the camera steady, Taylor. Jesus. Also to show you guys, here is the coffee table that we picked up for $100 off of Facebook Marketplace. How great. We have to refinish the top because there's like, I don't even know, where, where are the sparkle bits? There are sparkles and stains and different things. Oh good, dad. <laughs> Okay, so my mom and I are now on our way to the Monica Hibbs barn sale or barn house sale. She's got a bunch of her home goods out for sale in her barn on her property and I bought tickets for my mom and I to go so that we can kind of go check it out. She's got a bunch of stuff that definitely suits my style but a lot of it is on the pricier end, so I thought going to the sale might be the perfect thing to do. However, we're going at 3 p.m. and it started at 11. So I'm hoping that there are still some good finds when we get there, but we'll just have to wait and see. Wow, this is amazing. and I just finished at the barn sale and it was so good we got such great deals but now we're tucking into some churros from Hugo's they had a little Hugo's truck and I've had a Hugo's tacos before and they're amazing but I haven't tried their churros so okay that is really good mm -hmm. mm, so crispy it's very nice having a mother-daughter outing like this and doing things that we enjoy doing like shopping. What's this? Why are you giving the camera that? I don't know. What? <laughs> it's the angle. There. <laughs> I feel like that looks more normal but you were literally going like this. <laughs> <laughs> no idea. Okay well I guess it's back to Tawasin and when we get there I will show you guys what I got. All right, you guys, I am back at my mom and dad's house and it is finally time to show you what I bought while I was at the barn sale. Okay, so the first thing I got is this road trip bag, so cute. I think from what I saw on the walls, the road trip bag usually goes for $50 and I got it for 35, so that's really great. Excited to use that. The next piece is this little 
tray. It's like a wooden tray. I plan to put some lemons and oranges in here. Just decorate it with fruit, even avocados. Avocados in this would be really gorgeous. Put it in the kitchen. This is usually $49, it says on the bottom, and I got it for $15. Really excited about that one. So the next thing I got is this berry bowl. I think it is so cute. I love the color. It's like this gray green, and I think it'll look really pretty with our off-white cabinets. The regular price of this is $28, and I got it for 10. Ben and I eat tons of berries. He absolutely loves his blueberries. I constantly have them stocked in the fridge at home when we have our own fridge. So I think that'll come in handy. The next piece is this blanket. There's a little patch on here that says there's no place like home and I am a big Wizard of Oz fan. So that really spoke to me. I wanted to get a throw blanket that was a bit of a darker color because our couch is so light. So I thought to add some depth to this space or add some variety and color tones. I do like a little bit of a darker moment. On the tag here, it says that it's usually $80, but I got it for 45. Oh my gosh, I wanna cozy up with this right now. I guess I could, I'm just gonna be hanging out in bed after this, so. <laughs> okay, and the last thing that I got is this little stool. I love it so much, it is so cute. Oh my gosh, I have no idea what I'm gonna do with it, but I just saw this like mini stool and I was like, oh my God, I have to have that, what the heck? And I pulled this out of my bag to show my dad when we got home and he was like, oh my God, I love that. And I was like, I know, why do I love this so much? And it's got a green sticker on it, which means it was $25 which no clue how much this usually goes for, but $25 for this little thing, I'm happy about that. Anyway, these are all of the pieces that I got. Also, the road trip bag, can I put it in there? Yes! <laughs> and thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like, or leave a comment, or even subscribe. That would be amazing if you would. Stay tuned because eventually I will be decorating my new home with all of these pieces and you'll get to see exactly how I do that. I'm gonna go lie in bed now and do absolutely nothing other than watch a movie because it's the first night I'm able to do that in a long time. So thank you again for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.